One of the biggest steaks I've seen in a minute. Specifically, they call it churrasco. To me, it's just big steak. Over here, we have something very common in Colombia. We got some arepas, marcia, blood sausage. I've never had blood sausage before, so I saw that. I was like, you know what? Let me experiment. I love trying new things. This is uh, chicharron, which is pretty much fried pork. It's thick bacon. Pan de bono, which is a round baked cheese bread. I love cheese. Pastel de yuca. You are very free to correct me if I'm wrong. Another thing I'm really hyped about is an empanada. Specifically, a meat-filled empanada. Also, we have some plantains. We got these roasted potatoes. We got rice. Chimichurri sauce over here. Picked up from a place called La Fonda Antiquenia. Yeah. So, Colombia, I need you to check in. And I did get it cooked medium. So let's see. If you love steak, give this a thumbs up. Here we go. Giant New York steak cooked medium rare. Looks good to me. Chimichurri sauce on everything though. That's what I'm talking about. Butter your steak. This is good steak. So I do like how they cut it. So you have these slices, if you could see that. So far, this is pretty perfect. Buttery steak. Mmm. It's actually quite tender. And the flavors inside of this are good. Whatever marinade they use, real marks on there. Part of me just wants to pick it up and take a bite. Thumbs up if you've ever done this before. You guys don't understand. I'm definitely a big steak fan. And so far, this is just money. I'm just going, now I'm going to start trying the other things. Already, I started off by dipping this arepa, which I think is made out of a masa. It seems soft. Oh, and maybe a little chewy. It's like I just bit into a pillow. It tastes like rice. So I'm definitely gonna use this with the other things. I think that's how you do it. Colombians, again, anytime you watch Chime In and tell me how to do this right. I love steak. Mm. Just a casual Wednesday, little light lunch on YouTube. They gave me this sauce. I'm gonna try it. I probably did something really wrong. I was thinking about using A1, but you know, sometimes you just gotta respect the flavor, so. The spices in this are crazy. Oh, it's beans. I forgot about the beans. Okay, they're beans. Not gonna lie, I just pulled a Q-Trong. Somewhat burnt my tongue. Okay, um, I'm gonna try this. This looks really freaking good. It looks like pork belly chicharron. Yo. 
that is fatty and delicious. Look at this. It's literally like a thick fried slab of bacon. It's not as like salty as bacon. I can tell this thing has some calories up in there. Mmm. Yo, dude, Colombian food is freaking lit. Let me get some rice. And also, if you're new to the channel, what I want to do this year is try every cuisine I can, and there will be many more to come. Oh, that's good rice. This is nice. This is their plantain. I love plantain. Let me get a little bit more of this going though. Yeah, it's definitely not as salty as bacon, but I can feel it's heavy. Mmm. Cause that's just pretty much fat. But it's crispy. Chicharron. Colombia knows what's up, guys. Yeah, I'm gonna try this blood sausage. I know in England they have blood sausage. That looks pretty cool, but this should be rich. Yo, this is fire. Blood sausage, pretty good. What was the name of this? Morcia. I think this is my favorite thing I've had so far. Like, the outer skin has this pop when you bite in. Flavor is very, it's like a subtle savoriness. Not too, like, super salty. I think there's rice inside of it. If you look really closely. But... This is like my favorite thing to do on the channel, guys. Trying new foods, different flavors, stuff that's new to me. Like that in itself is a good meal to me. And just kind of testing my taste buds. I don't know if anybody feels the same, but... That is bomb. Pan de Buno. And I think it's like a cheese bread. chimichurri sauce with the oil it's like a garlic roll mmm very fluffy What just stood out is that the the outer top has a saltiness. Yo, Colombia, thank you. We're doing it, guys. some really good steak. Dude, I'm taking it back. 
Colombian food is like this is fire because it's like a mixture of cultures. It's like a steak that you'd see at a steakhouse, but then you have the plantains, you have the rice going. This is really cool. I'm glad I did this today. Let me know because I love it. Mm. Anyone else out there love chimichurri? It tastes like rice and oil. Mmm. Mmm. This is very, very bomb. And damn, the churrasco itself. The seasonings they use, and it's one of the juiciest steaks I've ever had. And then you dip it in the oil. I might try this. I don't know what this is. I love steak, period. But even the chewing itself allows you to respect the flavors a little longer. I always enjoy steak dinners, and trust me, I don't eat with my hands at the dinner table. Mmm. Oh, wow. These potatoes. Fire. <laughs> Colombia is a beautiful country, by the way. I've always wanted to travel there. So that's definitely gonna happen in the future. And if you're Colombian, maybe I could stay at your place for a bit. We'll do a lot of eating. So bomb, guys. If there's one thing from all this so far, what would you hit? I'm sorry, but blood sausage, you're going to see a lot more of it. Mmm. This is really heavy. This is what's up. Mmm. That was fantastic. Wow. Frijoles con arroz. Simple deliciousness. Wait, did you guys hear that? Hello? Yeah, you want to subscribe? Oh yeah, no, no, just hit the red button below the video. It should be like right down there. Yeah, that one. Mm -hmm. And then just hit the bell. Cool, yeah. So this is the empanada. And let's see what's inside. Ooh. I know I'm gonna like this. Out of bounds. That meat is so tender. Fried cornbread outside. Mmm. This is amazing. I don't want to dip in the oil. 
Yo, this is one of the best empanadas I've had. Mmm. Mmm. Also, if you ever are thinking about trying this, this would be a food that I think most people would enjoy. This is delicious. You need to go try Colombian food. I have grown to like the arepa with the plantain. Mm hmm. So I think it's kind of like a. You would dip it in sauce. Like, like stuff like this, like the beans. These beans, though, are like really good pinto beans. Mmm. It's a really good flavor on them. Mmm. We got pastel de yuca. I love yuca, so let's uh, let's break this baby open. Actually, it's really like it feels like the two slajour donuts. Like it feels like this is kind of chewy, so I'm just gonna bite. Mmm. That is like Holy Jesus Damn like a sticky fried exterior, but on the inside it had this like savory like hamburger meat That was freaking bomb the blood sausage the steak and that favorite things Of the day. Definitely more Colombian food to come. Mm. Okay. Two more plantains. This is like a good lunch. And dinner. <laughs> this is really good chicharron. It's just really heavy. It's That's literally like thick bacon. So, Colombian food is really bomb but thank you so much for watching spending some time with me check out some of these playlists if you want to watch more but anyways peace magic gang you rock i will see you in the next video cheers mm -hmm. and then just hit the bell cool